Let's take a look at the tools the platform offers that support project and data management. Throughout this video, we'll go through this example of a CAD revision process. The orange P represents a project management duty, while an orange D represents data management. We'll start at the top with the manager creating a detailed markup of changes that need to be made. From there, the manager will assign a task to someone on the team, notifying them they're responsible to make the changes. After that, the manager will make the rest of the team aware that a change will be made to the project so that everyone is on the same page. The engineer assigned to the task would reserve the CAD files, ensuring the files cannot be edited by anyone else at that time. Once they've made their changes, they'll save and bump the revision of the files. They notify the project manager that they're finished with their changes. And finally, the manager sends the CAD files to release once they approve the changes. With Collaborative Industry Innovator in the 3D Experience platform, we can create detailed markups of 3D models. After choosing a point of view, use the built-in measuring tools to add dimensions pulled directly from the model. Add annotations through text, arrows, pictures, and more. This markup will be used to communicate design changes to the engineering team. It can also be saved in the platform to revisit later. Everyone can access their own set of tasks. View a list of tasks owned by you and assigned to you. These tasks can be organized by the maturity state shown here or by due date. When creating a new task, add information such as details, a due date, a team member responsible, and attachments for the assignee to reference. Communicate design changes to the entire team in a collaborative environment. This space gives the team an opportunity to make comments on the changes shown. Tag team members in posts and comments so they receive a notification. Use the 3D Experience add-in within SOLIDWORKS to access platform content such as your tasks. Change the maturity state of this to in work to let the task owner know you've started working on it. Preview attachments of tasks without having to leave SOLIDWORKS. Currently these CAD files are read only. In order to get right access, I have to reserve them. Files with a red lock symbol show that the file is currently reserved by somebody else. Now I can make the appropriate changes to the model since I have these files reserved. At this point, no one else is allowed to modify them. This avoids two engineers making edits on the same files at the same time, and ultimately avoids duplicate copies of the files. Once I'm finished with the changes, I can save the changes to the platform and unreserve the files so they're available for others to edit. Now that I'm finished with the changes, I'll save them to the platform. At the same time, I want to bump the revision of the affected files. I check the box to bump the revision of the frame outline and add a revision comment to better understand what changes were made in this revision. I can simultaneously unreserve the files after the save has been completed. Pay attention to the revision column within the 3D Experience add-in. The frame outline revision is updated from F.1 to G.1. Additionally, all the files are now read-only since I've unreserved them. Lastly, I can go back into the task and change the maturity state to completed. A manager can access these files in SOLIDWORKS or in the cloud. They can see the revision has been updated to G.1. These files have been sitting in the in-work lifecycle state. Once a design has been approved, the files can be sent to the released lifecycle state. You can get a higher level of project management with the project planning role. As you create tasks and specify how long each task may take, the platform automatically generates a Gantt chart for you. You can create task dependencies, which links one task to another. Now, if I update the estimated duration of the driving task, the dependent task will automatically adjust. If you're interested in learning more, reach out to your account manager or contact us through the number or email listed.